Hi, this is Malisha Bailey with Love for Life Wellness, and I'm just here talking about our exciting 12-day journey of health and wellness by doing a food and juice cleanse. And sometimes when we're talking about cleanses, people think of starvation, and or I'm going to be drinking juice for 12 days, but no, this is a full journey. We're going to be eating good healthy foods, putting some good juices in our bodies, but also we are taking a journey inside to help us to become and be the best we can be. We're going to be journaling, we're going to be setting goals, we're going to be visualizing what we want to have and achieve in our lives. We're going to be saying affirmations, telling ourselves how wonderful we are, how great we are. We're going to be doing gratitude journeys talking about all the things we're grateful for, just grateful for just waking up this morning, grateful to have life, liberty, and we can pursue happiness. We're going to be talking about doing a healthy grocery list. And with this journey, I we will be providing everything that you need. I've got this beautiful 12-day um, guide, and it, every day it tells us what we're going to be doing. And so it tells us what we're going to be eating. So it takes the guesswork out of everything. You don't have to, you, to think about too much. All you got to do is go to your, 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 your booklet and just do it. And it's also t thinking, talking about our thoughts. What are we thinking as we're doing this cleanse? And it's about cleansing our body from the inside, but it's also about cleansing our minds too. We got to cleanse our mind from stinking thinking and thinking that we're not the best. We are the best. We can do anything and we can do anything for 12 days. And so it's just a small time bit of time, but it's going to reap so many benefits. We're going to be getting our body clean of different things that sugars and processed foods and too much caffeine. And we're going to be doing a little bit of movement. We're going to be doing some journaling. We're going to be doing some visualizations. We may do some yoga if that's what you want. We're going to be talking about inflammation. And every day there will be something that we will be um, focusing on. And so, and what I love about this is that we are saying awesome affirmations to ourselves. We are telling ourselves how great we are, how wonderful we are, how God loves us and how we can do anything. We're gonna be journaling our thoughts and what are we going through? And it, it may be hard, the first two or three days may be hard. But that's okay. If you can get over by the time you start day three, you got to be set to go. And so you may have some symptoms, but don't be afraid of the symptoms because the symptoms means that your body is purging and getting rid of stuff that it doesn't need. And so, um, and what I like about this is that we're talking about caffeine. Um, caffeine, I love my coffee. And so, um, but we're going to be replacing coffee with teas. And so I'm not going to tell you to totally give up the things that you love, but we're going to be replacing them with some other things. We're going to be talking about our detox symptoms. We may get some headaches. We may feel tired. So that's why we're going to start the detox on a, on a Thursday so that by the time the symptoms kick in on Saturday or Sunday, you will be over them and then you can start your day on Monday. We'll have a VIP Facebook page. We will have a Zoom classes. We will have conference calls. I am going to be with you every step of the way. We're going to be setting goals. What are your goals? What do you want to achieve in your life? What, how do you want to feel? If you're not feeling good, do you want to feel better? If you're feeling good, do you want to feel better than that? Do you want to have energy and vitality? It's early morning. I'm on my way to work out, but I feel good because I've got up this morning. I set my intentions. I set my goals. I did some journaling. And this is what we're going to be talking about on this 12-day journey. It's a journey and it's going to be fun. And you're going to have people there that are going to be with you. We're going to have a whole team of people that are going to be here and we're going to be 
pushing each other forward to do this. And we're going to be thinking and visualizing what do we want to see at the end of this? What do we want to see happen? What do we want to see happen as a part of this journey? Um, we're going to, I will provide you with a shopping list. I will provide you with a recipe books that will help you. We'll be talking about the best type of foods that we can um, put in our bodies. We're going to be drinking good water, lots and lots of water, nice lemon water. And we're going to talk about inflammation, inflammatory foods. Because once you get on this detox and you start getting rid of some of the things, you're going to start feeling better. Your joints are going to stop aching. You're going to have an energy and vitality. You're going to be thinking more clear. And so that's what inflammation does. It helps you. It makes you feel groggy. It makes your joints hurt. It keeps you from thinking clearly. We're going to be doing a little bit of exercise. Not a whole lot. Now, if you're an exercise junkie like me, you're going to ramp it up but if not just a little bit of movement every day get those bodies moving get that endor those dwarf those feel good endorphins activated so that you can continue on we don't want this just to be a 12-day journey we want this to be a life journey and we may do a little bit of yoga. I know some people don't like yoga, but that's okay. Yoga is just basically stretching, stretching your body, stretching those muscles, stretching those lig ligaments. We're going to talk about dry brushing. We're going to talk about getting some sunshine. And we're going to talk about juicing and eating healthy. And so this is a great way to get um, you motivated, um, to get rid of the stuff that if you may have eaten over the holidays. And yes, it's February and sometimes it's hard after we've eaten bad through the holidays to get started and to continue on with our setting our goals. So 2019 is going to be a great year. This detox is going to be a great way to um, um, start thinking about how do you want to end 2019? Do you want it to be better than 2018? Or do you want to continue on with the way things were? We want to get better. We want to be moving forward. And so this detox is not only helping our bodies, but it's going to be helping our minds. We're renewing our minds each and every day. And by putting the right things in our body, it's going to help us. And so those that are local, we're going to be doing a, ju a detox at the classic rock you can go to my facebook page get your tickets get them in advance and for those that are not here in springfield you can participate in it as well you buy your ticket i will provide you with the recipe book with your detox journal you'll have a um, special vip page you'll be a part of our conference calls and then you will be a part of our celebration and so this is in for anybody from california to new york that wants to join us on 12 days Days. We can do anything for 12 days and, and it won't be that hard, I promise. We're not going to just be juicing, but we're going to be eating good foods and putting good things in our body. So I'm excited. I hope you'll get excited with me. Join Love for Life Wellness on this journey. 12 days of an all natural cleanse, eating healthy foods and putting good juices and drinks in our bodies. So until next time, we look forward to um, you joining us. And I'm so excited and I hope you're excited too. Take care. God bless.